Okay, so this is the Unity Arena t a mini tower from Colink. Don't let the outer box phase you because from the pictures and what I've seen online, this looks absolutely amazing. So let's get this unboxed and let's take a look. So let's take off the top. Right then, so in terms of the packaging, it does come with a very good foam, very good quality, and it does have like cardboard sides just to keep it nice and secure. So let's get this foam off and take a good, good look at it. So yeah, very good foam, very, very good. This will definitely hold up in shipping. Here now and this done. Okay, so now this is a brand new case from Colink. It's lit just come out a couple of days ago. And let's take a good look, is it? Ooh. Okay, now I'm really getting Lee and Lee vibes from this case. Right, okay. So, right, now I'm getting Lee and Lee vibes. Anyone else? Because I certainly am. Now, it does have a pop out for the glass. Right here. Big temper glass side window, and it does have metal around the side, so these would. Wouldn't have to worry about cracking it. Now, in terms of the inside, let's take a good look. So, when it comes to the fans, it does come with these nice fans, but here it does have like a uh, mirror effect on the fans. These are reversed fan blades, so it pulls in there. Now, in terms of motherboard support, it does support up to an ATX motherboard, but I'm sure it supports EATX, if I remember correctly from what I read in the description now i'm getting very lee and lee vibes and personally it comes with a hard drive mount which to be honest in 2024 you shouldn't really use it does come with this because you can put the graphs card vertical so it does come with a vertical mount now it is full glass as you can actually see by there now it does come with a massive user guide that's the user manual, rather big, tells you everything you need to know and of course tells you the orientation of the graphs card. So, now what I will say is what really got me this is the overall look to Lee and Lee cases. Now, I mean it's, you know, it's really up to you, but you know that's your personal preference now my personal preference is different to many people so let's take a good look at this case okay so like i said it will support the biggest graphs card you could fit in here so a 4090 would fit in here absolutely no problem not a fan with the uh included hard drive mount it's not many people use hard drives these days, so I don't know why that would be an option. But like I said, it comes with th three 120s and then a 120 at the back. Now it is full glass, sorry about that, around the side. And then of course it's got ventilation on the back. So, let's take this off now. Okay, it does come with a removable dust filter as well. So, ah, oh, comes with SSD mounts by here. It does support very long power supplies if you take out the, well actually, no, actually, no, 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 this isn't removable, so it just basically supports that amount. It does have an included ARGB header, which is rather good because it comes with fan splitters, which does support four pin PWM. So in terms of RGB, I'm assuming it's everywhere. The fans and stuff obviously will be pre-attached now like i said it does support 120s but it does support 140s so this could fit initially a 420 rad but that is to be seen but i think by the overall look it should should fit it no problem 
So in terms of I.O., as you can see, Type-C, two USB 3, headphone, microphone jack, I'm assuming, reset button, big power button, and obviously hard drive indicator, LED. Now, yes, it does have a magnetic dust filter on top. So, yeah. And for the top, as you can see, there is an offset of the motherboard tray, so at least you could fit a 360 or a 420 here, which does look like the spacing, so it's not bad at all. Now, it is rather tall for the mid-tower, but as you can see, there is an actual gap there or an offset between the motherboard and the top. But, yeah, I actually do like it. It does have seven PCI slots, so it is classed to the mid-tower. Any more would be classed to the full-tower. And overall, the build quality seems fine. The metal seems okay. I like the overall glass out the side, the fans included. That's really nice. Does come with rubber stoppers or feet to the bottom or with a removable dust filter, which is rather nice. So, yeah. Okay, and so that's the Colink Arena case. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I've got more stuff coming. I've got a power supply, which I will show you which is by here. It is called the Regulator and it is from Colink. It's a thousand watt power supply. I also have an AIO coming as well. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I hope you got a fantastic week ahead of you and weekend. This is Rich Welsh Tech. Good bye.